Hi guys, Postman's Bin. So this is another Grandad's Postbag episode. Two items. Uh, we'll leave the little box because I know what that is. But actually, I know what this is because I can feel it. It's sort of soft and floppy. And it's an Amazon purchase. Fataki powder, Fataki, Fataki, alum powder. Um, has various uses. Some people use it in their food. Some people use it for rubbing on their face when they've been shaving to stop any little cuts and nicks. And some people use it to make batteries. Like those um, ones I made with, what was it? Epsom salts the other day. So that's what I bought it for, to make a battery. Not sure quite when I'll get around to doing it, but uh, that's what it is. I can't remember what the chemical content is. Um, no, I'll just be guessing. I'll put it on the screen somewhere to see what it is. But it's one of those things that some of my friends, uh, Slider2732, uh, Lid Motor, have used to make rechargeable batteries. So, that's what that is. Whether it works with this food quality stuff or not, I don't know. We will find out when we do it. Right. And the other thing we've got, this little box here, which I have already cut open to be honest, so I do know what's inside it. It's from one of my friends. <laughs> yeah. Okay, little project will work, any car, etc. Ardumotive.com Ardumotive BT Karen HTML. I got permission to copy, alter, and sell from Ardumotive. So, what have we got here? Something to put together. I actually have no idea what it is, although it seems it says it works with any car. I'll try not to lose any of the bits and pieces if we have a look inside. Transmit, receive, reset, ground, 5 volts. Reset, 5 volt power, V motors, Bluetooth module, which I'm guessing hmm, don't know. Uh, servo, motor DCBA. That's mega, or at mega, at mega, 328P, L293D, L293D, no, A and B. Yeah, okay. Crystal there, the beeper there, some other bits and pieces. Okay, we don't want to lose the bits, so we'll... Put it back together. Have a look at that sometime. Mm. Okay, and then this one is 
and from a or for a um, sort of solar rocker type thing, I think. Smart Creations 2010 version 1.3. Ground 1.5 volts. Power in. Coil, which is what we have here. A couple of 3D printed bits. There's one already assembled. So it's the coil out of one of those solar rockers, just nicely put into a 3D printed container, and then a couple of prongs on there, need a couple of jumper leads to connect the two together, and that will work. Mm. Yeah, okay, so a couple of little projects to get on with at some time. I don't know if you can hear in the background, but it has just come on to rain. And it's that time of year when it's going to be dark nights, and I'll be wanting to do things indoors. So that should be ideal. Let's see if we can rig something up with them. That's a bit of a surprise, I wasn't expecting that. So, yeah. I was just expecting that on its own. But he slipped a few other little bits and pieces in there to keep me occupied, I suppose. So, uh, yeah. Um, his YouTube channel goes under the name of Tellboy. 2000 and something. I'll put a link in the video description because he's actually done a little video showing how to use this. So, uh, I don't know when I'll publish the video, this granddad is an old man post bag video. Because I'm about a month ahead on my videos at the moment and today is Wednesday the 30th of October. I suspect you won't see this video until the end of no November. Anyway, as I say, thanks Tellboy. And Slider 2732 and Lid Motor are the inspiration for, for tacky powder or alum powder. Thanks for watching. If you like that, then you might like this. And if you like this and that, you might like to subscribe over there.